Welcome to Farming Simulator 22. Yes, it's out. Uh, I've actually been playing it already uh, quite a while. <laughs> what has it been out? Two weeks now? Probably something like that, I think. Or one week? I don't know. But I've played a lot. <laughs> so, I'm going to start off a new save and we're going to go for the start from scratch. We're going to make this hard. We're going for the hardest of hard. And we're going to go Holt Bayron, which is the French map. As you can see, I've got quite a few little mods, nothing amazing. And let's go. Right, so we're ready to go, I believe. That's who, how I'm going to set myself up. So let's get in it. Right, first things first. Uh, we're going to quickly just put this on real time right and we'll just quickly go through what we're doing so economy is on hard um we've got seasons on we've got everything on traffic all of that visuals yes uh crop destruction no that's the only thing i am turning off everything else i will leave on the stones the lime in the weeding all of that um uh, i'll have that turn they're gonna turn on Du, 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 fuel I'm going to turn that to low all right just because otherwise I'm just permanently going back to back to the petrol station uh, and it's not that expensive so it's not exactly like a big huge game changer and everything else turned off okay so let's have a look at what we got here uh, what do we have oh we have a wheat field we got wheat here we have wheat there well that's being bought then but what we got here if was that cotton i think that's cotton it's cotton oh dear and what we got here fertilize we did everything completely done oh not stones oh well, there's a few stones on the edge oh god now you see the the problem is right this this field not a problem yes great we want that that's 81 i'm buying it it's as simple as there's and it's wheat i need that because i need chickens but i want this piece of land this piece <sighs> and they're about the same price but it's this big piece flat piece of land where you can build all of your bits and pieces on at the beginning uh, it's, it's very expensive to do like landscaping and stuff so you want nice flat land and that is but the cotton do we just dig it straight up oh, or do we rent I mean I could rent but I just don't think it was gonna it would be worth it uh, we're, we're, we're gonna buy it so that's the land sorted we have our land we have this land this piece of land and that piece of land nice as you see in the bottom left the, the little mini map they've gone blue so right we've got a harvest we have a half oh, 75 percent weeds oh it's not going to be a lot but we do have a harvest to do okay in this month that one won't be cotton isn't until the end is it until like end of september october something like that cotton October November so we've got quite a while to think about that and the wheat we're in August so we've only got this month to harvest it and then if we wanted to plant wheat or or barley again we would have to be planting next month okay so let's start thinking about some machinery before we buy look there we've always got to have a look here um, what is here um, we've got a topper a disc harrow cultivator I mean I'm gonna need all of these things but not right at the beginning I need a tractor and there's no second-hand tractor damn it um, small tractors what we got I mean I need something powerful I'm gonna need something quite quite big I mean these are all like 
68 horsepower. Hmm. Well, I'm going to have a look through. And when I find, if I find something, then I'll bring it. I am on a budget. And because I'm on a budget, I'm thinking this guy. Um, it's the Voltra Valmet H750. There you go. Ah. Um... We've got to have wide tyres. No wheel, wheel weights. Oh, never mind. Uh, we, we will buy it with either a quick or a howler. Which one? We'll go with the quick. Might as well. Uh, what colour? Their main colour. Should we have a main colour going through? Oh, just Or everything just keep things all the same colorish or should we go for a special different color I quite like that yeah I quite like that and for the plate um, what we do let's go I suppose it's day one in it <laughs> Where, where you go? Where you go? Why? There you go. Uh, out power on. Day one. Boom, boom, boom. Front and back. Do that. Bye. That's about the best we could do for the price. 190 horsepower. It's not exactly loads, is it? Here it is. The uh, Vulture of Almet. There I am as well. Ha <laughs> ha. Well cool. I'm liking that. that. That looks pretty awesome. So, we're going to need... Let's think. We have a wheat field that needs to be harvested. Do we invest in a harvester? In just like a little one or something? Uh, what have we got? Let's have a. Why am I in here? I should be in here. Harvester. I've, I've got actually this one, which is how big? 5 6. Let's have a look. Do, do, do. Where's the old. There we go. Harvesters. But that's 75 at 4.9. And can have a 5 meter and a 3.4 meter header. Uh, this one, 5.6, so slightly bigger. And can have a 4 meter. So that's four meters. What was this other one? And that's 55k. This is 75 with five meters. And it's brown. Oh. Come on, how much? 25k. That's 100k. It's 100k. Or do we lease it? Let's have a look. Uh, how much would it cost to lease? Three grand. <clears throat> yes, do it. So it's like five grand. So from here, uh, la, 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 you, I need you. I need a trailer, is what I need now. Trailer. Uh, what are we going to go for? Hmm. Once again, bring it back once I've decided. Right, yeah, I'm going to go for this, 12,000. And the reasons why as well is because, look, it's got all of the configurations. So I'm going to go for this. 
which is the Stroutman and we're going to buy that that's 13 grand so we can now go and harvest that field the other field is guaranteed to be needing to be weeded the cotton and all that but I'm really unsure what to do with that I may literally dig it up straight away and start like plowing and all of that sort of stuff so let's get this this guy back to our fields and starting him going on the old harvesting um, I'm gonna do it myself I don't I could easily do workers but look at the money it's already gone down 140k left and I want to put some chickens down and I want to get some greenhouses down and I don't really want to take out another loan and I say another loan I haven't taken out a loan but the game has already for me uh, out of that 500,000 that we actually started with 200k of it is actually a loan so at the end of the each month we're also going to get charged interest on that so that's going to cost us money each month so I want to get that paid off as quickly as possible so that's the like the early on missions but let's get down to our field and get this going now I don't think we're going to get a lot out of it I'll be surprised if we get if we get 10k out of here I'll be happy considering it's got like 75% weeds I don't even think it had been fertilized let's have a look let's have a look what state it was in see unfertilized and 75% weeds so it's not exactly a great crop that's for sure so let's get going in here and harvesting oh, I can't the goddamn trees in a blimmin get out of the way tree they're already saying that they're going to get cut down aren't they <laughs> I don't think that tree wants to get stuck there for too long now I'll try and give you some of the you know better pictures stuff coming out of the back are we still online? no not really we always, I always end up doing uh, like the hedgerows first don't know why I just do I get all of the corners and all of the edges out of the way and then quite often I'll just switch over to a worker but getting a worker right at this moment is pretty expensive now I've got swath on here haven't I so I could bale that up but I I don't like I don't enjoy baling put it that way because um, I don't enjoy loading loading trailers I hate loading trailers I actually quite enjoy using like a pallet truck in real life but um, I don't enjoy it in, like loading up trailers and that in this game and doing trying to get bows especially round ones <laughs> to not roll off and do, it's just oh bow stacking yeah so I'm not sure whether I'll keep this off and off or whether I'll just like cultivate it in I'm not sure or I may I may lease a baler and then and then like one of those auto pickup ones it all depends on how many bows I get out of this field but like straw at the moment I don't need it but it is a bonus it's quite you know out of this field I might get five six grand out of it something like that maybe maybe more out of just some straw bows so we've got to think about it anyway I'm gonna get this field harvested up I'll probably put it on time-lapse that would probably be the best way if I do that because otherwise these these are these videos are gonna go on for a real long time so I will see you when I'm getting closer to the end
Right, well, coming to the end of this first ever harvest for us on this new enterprise of becoming a rich farmer tycoon. <laughs> and even though, you see, this, this is not a cash crop. I'm not going to get any money out of this wheat. I might get some money out of the straw. I'm undecided what to do yet. I do have to make up my mind pretty quick if I want to put wheat or barley back it down in here. Because there's a lot of processes to go through until, you know, until we can <laughs> start thinking about another crop. So, done. Awesome. So happy. And I think we've got around 10 grand's worth of, I think, we must have around 10 grand's worth of... Oh, why, why, why are you still spitting out stuff? Why? Why do you always do that? Now it's all messy. Look. Oh, I don't know. Right, we'll do that. Um, go and collect. I think, yeah, I was going to say, we've got about 11,000, which is what, if, if I remember right, is what I said, probably in this field. Because of the non-fertilising. If this was completely fertilised, mulched, ploughed, I bet we've got to plough it. Let's have a look at the state of this field now, because this is important. Right, the state of the field that we are in, it needs lime. Okay, let's turn the lime off. It doesn't need ploughing. Okay, so we, we don't need to plough, but it does need liming. So after liming, we we're going to want to cultivate or something to put that lime down in the ground so or we would need a drill yeah yeah mm, a drill cedar we'll, we'll have to think about that one as well um, but I want to load this up and then we're gonna have like 11 thousands worth of wheat which is exactly what I was praying for and hoping for because now I can put down some chickens and chickens are gonna be literally the um, they're going to be the main deal in this <laughs> in this save right at the beginning they're going to keep us going um yep that's that so next process is going to construction and we're going to get some chickens down and this is not going to be bad for day one within like first hour or whatever you know play to be able to get this down and go in i'm pretty pleased with that so where are we going to want it i'm thinking over here somewhere um right they're going to come out there we're going to be wanting to turn in and out there so back a bit because <laughs> it's me probably back there <laughs> my driving that's not looking too bad what about straightness and stuff yeah not too bad so uh, we're gonna want more than one so we're gonna so one there we could then probably get another one there and maybe then another one in here after a later date as well we're only putting one down today that's for sure i would like to put more than one down but I don't think it would be practical at the moment but what I do have is enough to be able to get some decent amount of chickens in uh, going now so and uh, I haven't got a house remember I don't have a house I've only got 60 grand left and I don't have a house so I've got nowhere to sleep so at the moment I'm just gonna have to pass time very quickly like at night times so I won't be doing darkness anyway because it's not very good for video <laughs> right so chickens two prices as you see like we'll, we'll, we'll get the rooster first uh, because I do want them to produce more without the rooster they won't produce more chickens you'll only get eggs um, but I'm gonna need them to produce chickens and then at a later date we can sell chickens as well but the the main chickens are these ones these are going to produce eggs straight away and they will breed straight away so how many of these do we want I'm going for fifteen 
50 of them, I think. We can afford it. Yes. And then baby chickens. We're going to buy another 50. Okay. They won't produce anything. These ones won't produce anything. Uh, for, I think, it's until they're six months. Well, it says reproduction, two months. But I thought it was six months. Unless that's just been changed. But, yeah. They'll start moving up and you'll see a difference anyway in the ages and stuff and so now we have a hundred animals but no food so now we better give them some food now this chicken coop can take 9,000 litres of of wheat barley or sorghum so it's nearly going to empty this container right out and if this was completely full up with 360 chickens in here then we would be getting um oh, i hate that collision bit i hate, i don't like that right so there we go We've still got two thousand left they'll eat around that every day when this is completely full up and so i do not have a lot you know to go spare if you understand what i mean but we are a go chickens are a go so now we have 58 grand and I've got to decide what to do with it but that's enough for today that's all I can do today we've harvested we've got a harvest we're going to think about the straw and uh, baling and all that lot in the next one um, but we've got the chickens down and that's the main thing it means we're going to start getting some eggs in here you can go in here it's all a bit awkward though because of levels of ground and stuff like that i don't know they just don't like it after these things <laughs> but yeah i think that'll do for today because it's become already quite a long video but we haven't done bad we've got a harvester we got chickens and we've got this wicked looking awesome vulture helmet tractor and trailer so anyway, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, don't forget to hit the like button. And subscribe if you're new and you haven't before. If you'd like to see more, <laughs> leave a comment down below and I'll get back to you. Everybody and anybody out there, you guys have a really nice day. Tala.